People started lining up as early as 5 a.m. to cast their votes in person at Honolulu and Kapolehale Tuesday morning. The long lines continued through the afternoon. I'm surprised that there's this many people. I just thought it'd be just in and out, but two hours is, wow. Some wanted to vote in person, but didn't due to the long lines. We stood in line actually for over an hour. Um, we got some errands to do, our kids, we got to take care of our, our kids and such, so um, we decided to opt out and just drop our, drop our ballot inside of the, the drop box, but I, I definitely preferred to go in in person. Others didn't want their ballot to be lost in the mail. Only concern I was just that it wouldn't be counted if I missed, mailed a little too early or too late. And some didn't mind the wait. It's the American way. It's the American way, wanted to make sure the vote counted, make sure it got there. While it may have looked like a lot more people showed up at the polls, election officials at Honolulu Hale say the in-person turnout was comparable to 2016. The state's election officer says no ballot issues have been reported. The first report will be released after 7 p.m. with all votes received up until today. All in-person ballots will be counted by the 10 p.m. report.